Hello. Hope everybody had a great Monday. Shiloh wanted to say hello. So a little bit of drama over the weekend. Somebody stole my credit card number and ordered a bunch of pizzas. Not to my house, but just charged me for Domino's and then the next day for Cousin Vinny's so that I had to lock my uh, card so they couldn't charge anything anymore. So keep an eye on your accounts. There's a lot of fraudulent transactions going on right now. All right, today we're going to read the poem, The Song of the Shirt by Thomas Hood. All right, let's go ahead and take a look here. The Song of the Shirt by Thomas Hood. Narrated by Mount Carroll. With fingers weary and worn, with eyelids heavy and red, a woman sat in unwomanly rags, plying a needle and thread. Stitch, stitch, stitch. In poverty, hunger, and dirt. And still with a voice of dolorous pitch, she sang the song of the shirt. Work, work, work. While the cock is crowing aloof. And work, work, work. Till the stars shine through the roof. It's old to be a slave. Along with the barbarous Turk. Where a woman has never a soul to save. If this is Christian work. Work, work, work. Till the brain begins to swim. Work, work, work. Till the eyes are heavy and dim. Seen and gusset and band, band and gusset and seen. Till over the buttons I fall asleep and sew them on in a dream. O oh, men with sisters dear, O oh, men with mothers and wives, it is not linen you're wearing out, but human creatures' lives. Stitch, 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 in poverty, hunger and dirt, sewing at once with a double thread, a shroud as well as a shirt. But why do I talk of death, that phantom of grisly bone? I hardly fear its terrible shape, it seems so like my own. It seems so like my own, because of the fasts I keep, oh God. That bread should be so dear, and flesh and blood so cheap. Work, 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 my labour never flags, and what are its wages? A bed of straw, a crust of bread and rags, that shattered roof and this naked floor, a table, a broken chair, and a wall so blank, my shadow I thank, for sometimes falling there. Work, 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 from weary chime to chime. Work, 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 as prisoners work for crime. Band and gusset and seam, seam and gusset and band, till the heart is sick and the brain benumbed, as well as the weary hand. Work, 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 in the dull December light, and work, 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 when the weather is warm and bright. While underneath the eaves, the brooding swallows cling, as if to show me their sunny backs and twit me with the spring. Oh, but to breathe the breath of the cowslip and primrose sweet, with the sky above my head and the grass beneath my feet. For only one short hour, to feel as I used to feel before I knew the woes of want and the walk that costs a meal. Oh, but for one short hour, a respite, however brief, no blessed leisure for love or hope, but only time for grief. A little weeping would ease my heart, but in their briny bed, my tears must stop for every drop hinders needle and thread with fingers weary and warm with eyelids